place. Yes. Star Star Lord and another Gladius. Nice. Oh, oh, he's got the corkscrew. He knows what he's doing. It's gonna be a good fight. turn slowly get the circle closer slowly get the circle closer throttle up over the nose back into shield power back into the shot reverse the direction back into shield power oh he's doing good he's got some hits on me but probably a little too little too late Nice fight. Excited coming in. All right, guys. Today is going to be a nice short video because we want to talk about something specific here. So this was a good fight in 315 um, versus another Gladius that had come to um, take my bounty after uh, we had uh, <laughs> killed that Idris. And uh, I kind of just want to walk through what's happening here when it comes to counter maneuvering. And I want to highlight a, par a point during this fight which I see happening way too often when it comes to people uh, that I fight. And that's what's called over rolling. Okay. So a lot of times during a fight, um, everyone's trying to create like deflections on each other. We're trying to get so that, you know, it's difficult to, to get guns on the opponent. But a lot of times what ends up happening is like right, what you just saw just right there, um, over rolling. Okay, so it's creating too much, too much of a roll without any kind of meaningful avoiding of fire. Rolling in relation to your opponent, it's all relative. So if he pulls his nose off the target and just starts doing rolls, all I'm going to do is what you see here is I'm just going to look at his direction of travel and I'm going to pull my nose in that direction and just start saturating that area with bullets, right? So... When it comes to over rolling, it's just a bad habit a lot of people have, probably from old flight models where over rolling and over accentuation of movements actually rewarded you with avoiding fire. But now you have to you have to create that deflection with your position, right? So getting the proper distance, getting the orientation against your opponent right, moving into those S pattern turns, moving into those kind of Patterns that make it difficult to track your target less in the form of quick, like jerky motions and in much more of a smooth translational smooth kind of motion, right? So anyway, um, I see this all the time. It's a very bad habit. It gets you killed. So I just kind of wanted to nail this one home. Um, this was really what killed this Gladius pilot. Uh, he's just doing a lot of rolls that aren't really creating deflection relative to me. And he's just getting him shot, like he's just getting himself shot to pieces, right? So, a little tip for all you folks out there working on your dog fighting. I hope today's daily video was entertaining, and I hope it kind of uh, taught you something, right? So, uh, take a look at Predator mounts, guys, if you're looking for some mounts for your joysticks. Thank you so much, guys, for the love and support. I, I really enjoy doing this stuff. I hope to see you all out for the stream. I was Avenger One, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>